I think we're live everywhere. Hey everybody, hey it's Grim. Hey YouTube, hey Facebook. It's Erin Reed from Erin Reed Makes and oh, welcome to my channel. Today we're gonna do a really cool unboxing from a box I just got in from Erin Condren. I love Erin Condren, their planners are amazing and I can't wait to show you what's in this box. So, but before we get into that, let's introduce the show, like welcome to the channel and all that kind of fun stuff. All right, so before I jump into the unboxing, just a couple of quick things. Uh, first of all, hey, there's some people on Instagram. Hi. Uh, a couple of quick things. First of all, my Makers Retreat. My Makers Retreat is coming up, and it is in a little less than a month. There are still a couple of spots left if you want to join. And I just want to tell you the sponsors that are going to be part of this event. So the amazing sponsors, and these are the classes that we're going to be having while we're there. So it is my maker's retreat. It is just outside of Austin, Texas, and it's August 10th through 13th. Everything's included with the price, the food, the lodging, and all of the amazing classes, the swag bags, the amount of stuff you're going to get, the craftiness things that you are going to get you're going to want to come. All right. So we've got Sizzix. Sizzix is one of the amazing sponsors. They're sending swag bags. We've got classes. We've got all kinds of cool brand new releases from Sizzix that are going to be there. Deco Art. We're going to be doing water marbling with Deco Art. So it's going to be fantastic. Craft Express and Artists Free. We're going to be doing some sublimation and projects with them with some different elements. There's some really cool sublimation projects we're going to be doing. Edding is one of our amazing sponsors. We're going to be doing a few different projects with their new gloss acrylic marker. We're going to be creating some decor pieces and a card just to show you how cool their markers are. We have Style Tech Craft, which is vinyl. So we're going to be making some vinyl projects, including your wine glass that you get to have. So we're going to have a wine in the evenings and some fun little drinks. We also have Prickly Pear Stamps. They're going to be one of the awesome companies that we're going to be using a stamp project and creating some really cool cards. Uh, Zyron, everybody gets some sticker makers. And there's also some fun giveaways going on as well. And Catherine Pooler, we're going to be using her inks with Craft Express, sorry, with the Crafters Work, so, too many names with craft in it. With with the crafters workshop we're going to do some ink blending cards and they're going to be fabulous so some of these pro products have already started coming in the um and i just posted this up on is anybody on threads so i've been posting up on threads but i wanted to tell you the Catherine Pooler inks. This is one of the ones you're getting. This is awesome. We're going to be playing with crushed violet. It kind of goes with the theme of the box we're doing today, isn't it? Isn't that cool? So there's still a couple of spots left. It is going to be super, super fabulous. And I cannot wait for everybody to be a part of it. All right. So that is all the cool events. Oh, there's one more cool event going on. It starts, the launch is tonight. It is for the Cricket, Create with Cricket Joy. Let me say that again. Create with Cricut Joy. I do have, if you're on YouTube and Facebook, I have a uh, picture for you so you guys can see. Create with Cricut Joy. It is absolutely a free event. The link to join up for my uh, Makers Retreat and also for the Cricut Joy event is all in, if you're on Instagram, a link in my bio. If you're on YouTube and Facebook, a link is down in the information section so you guys can get that there. Um, it's an absolutely free. People have said, well, what if I don't own a joy? You can still be a part of it. What if I don't use a cricket? Well, you can get some cool ideas that you can still use for projects and home decor items and things. And you might be able to like tweak and amend it and rearrange your thought process if you don't have a cricket to cut things. Or if you've got a brother or a silhouette, it, it all kind of works. I mean, I'm my my project, my video is all using my maker because I don't own a joy either. But I've sized it down for those that do have a joy. Okay, so those are all the fun things that are going on. Let's get back to the unboxing. So Erin Condren, uh, we've been working together for a couple of years now. Um, I kind of got on the ball with them because they have a store just here in Austin. It's in the domain. It is a fabulous little store. It is so much fun. And it's all things planners and cool stuff. And ever since I went in the store, I kind of looked it up and I, you know, got connected with them. And so I've been on kind of a little, about a once a year rotation of getting some really cool projects coming in. So, um, hi Pam. Oh, she's coming. I'm so excited. She's coming in from out of state. So you don't have to be close by to be a part of the, the event. It's going to be a blast. Okay. So this is the latest box. They reached out and they're like, would you like the academic planner box? And I was like, yeah, sure. Let's get this. Let's get this thing. And so let's open this. So I'm going to flip the camera for YouTube and I'm going to flip it for Instagram here. So, oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. And flippy camera. Where's my little, there it is. Flippy camera. All right. Let's get everybody in on the cool stuff. All right. So this is such a, oh, let me get my, I'm in love with these licorice things. Sorry, 
don't, 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 don't hate me. <laughs> All right. So let's take a look at the cool stuff that's in here. Let me pull out one at a time. I am in love. I was so tickled pink. They have so many cool, let me get the box out of the way. They have so many cool um, companies that they work with that they do designs and Star Wars is one of them. So I was thrilled. I was so excited. I opened this up. I, I think I did an audible gasp in my house because I opened this up the other day just to see what it's all about. I haven't even taken it out of the packaging yet because I wanted you guys to see exactly what I got. And I am such a Star Wars nerd. So I probably should have taken it out of the plastic, but this is what you would get if you ordered. Now, the cool thing is for all of these products, these are available at Erin Condren. So the link is down below. These are brand new release. These are the academic planners, but they have the life planners and they have the other ones. And then they also, you can get these at Barnes and Noble. I put the link to go to both Erin Condren or to Barnes and Noble, or you could go to the Erin Condren in-person store. They have one in Austin. I believe there's one in Dallas and there's something on my desk. So I'm going to get rid of that. And obviously all Barnes and Noble across the world. Um, you can find uh, this specific product at the Barnes and Noble, all of the products at Erin Condren, obviously. So, all right, so let's take these out of here, but this is how you would get it. It comes in these really cool packaging. We're going to look at these one at a time. This, oh, uh, I am, I, anybody else just like the biggest Star Wars nerd? I've watched all the movies. I, I think my son, my oldest, beats me in terms of well, let's do one at a time. So I'm not overdoing how much we're getting. Okay, so here is the Planny Pack. This is a really cool planner thing. You can put things in here. I mean, I guess I could kind of open to show you, but you have the ability to store items in here. You got lots of little cubby pieces. It's even got a little logo in there. I love that. It's from Lucas. It's so cool. And then this attaches. So we're going to take a look at the little planner. You could use it. It does have like to show you, like you could put it with a spiral one, but you could totally use it with just a journal, right? So yeah, I am, my son has read the books. He's watched the TV shows. He's like all really into it. And look at the Grogu. I love it. He's on here. Baby Yoda. Before we knew his name was Grogu. Baby Yoda. But so cool. And you can get your planner, like the bigger planner with this as the cover. So all the covers you're seeing here, um, I, I kind of did a really quick look online to see all the options, but like this cover here, you could get on this one. Um, and these could be intermixed. So you don't have to, and then this cover too. So if you love the look of this little planner, but you like this cover, it comes in that. If you love the planner, but you want to have Grogu, you can get Grogu on there. So there's lots of options for that. Just to say, it's not like these come with just these designs. So you can take your journal in the back here. We're going to do the back side because I want to see Grogu's face. And you could pop this in here. And then now you've got your little journal right here and you've got your little planner. So it becomes this all in one thing. You can throw your pens in here. You can put all your fun stuff. And I love these little notebooks. I'm in so many meetings. This is how I use these planner notebooks. I mean, people love to journal and I'm not a journaling person, but I, I have to start doing a better job of taking notes when I'm on meetings about events or things or stuff that we need to do, or this is what I agree to do with the company or the company's doing for me. So I pretty much every time I have a new meeting, whether it's Zoom or a phone call, I'll make my notes in my journal. And I'm using one that I got from Erin Condren last time, but it's starting to get pretty full. So this will be my next one. And then I will take this also with me when I go on to my um, I go to like trips and conventions and things so I can make comments and journals and things like that. So this is just, it's just a great little notebook. My son got one that was a Star Wars one previously, my middle son, and he loves it. It is just, it's, it's awesome. And he doodles in it and stuff. So this is the focus notebook and you can put your name in there. It's just, it's cute, right? It's just so adorable. And then you have a little planny pack. And I love this. It says a heart of gold. Enjoy the little things with Yoda. And here we got uh, C-3PO. And here it says, may the force be with you with a symbol. You're, you are too kind. Ha ha. R2D2. Got it. You know, kindness matters. So I love how with like the Ewoks, I love how they're putting in some fun things that are Star Wars related, but just, you know, like feel good stuff. And it's just adorable. And then look at like down to like the symbols they have here. Right. And it's got like the, I don't know, I'm geeking out. I'm, I'm having, I'm totally having a moment here. There is also the stickers. So before we get into the planner, there's also the stickers. Um, and you can see all the stickers on the back, but let's open it up and really take a look at them. There we go. So there's a little sticker book. 
it's so pretty and they're foiled look at all the different ships and stuff you know Millennium falcon and you got all the planets and the death star and then here we go into some great sayings so uh do or do not there is no try like some big ones you know trust me jedi i am size matters not i love this judge me by my size do you never underestimate a rebel <laughs> fear is the path to the dark side so all the big quotes that you would you would love to like know and love here we have some other really cool little stickers. I mean, these are just fun, if, even if you're not a big planner person. They're just good Star Wars stickers. I mean, look at those. I love stickers. I don't tend to use them enough, but I just love the idea of them. Oh, and each one of these lightsabers says, I am your father. So it's on the red one, obviously, because it's the dark side. And then uh, I'm Luke Skywalker. I'm here to rescue you on the blue one. So here we have, you know, the light and the dark sides for all of those. I wonder if the same thing. I saw some... You know, fulfill your destiny, illumine as beings we are, hope is not lost, it is found, the force is strong with this one. Yeah, so even the colors on here, they did the dark side with the reds, and then the greens and the blues are obviously the, the light side, the Jedi. And here we have, I love the Ewoks. I think that was my favorite scene out of all the movies so far that I've ever seen is the one on Endor, and it's the battle where they're doing the light speeders and they're doing the racing. I love that one. I think also the reason why I love it, number one, there's Ewoks, but number two, because it had, um, Leia was taking force. Like she was the one in charge. She was the one leading, like it was a woman who was doing her thing and she, it wasn't a guy telling her what to do. And she, you know, she won over the Ewoks and yeah, anyway, I loved it. I'm a big fan, big fan. Don't push my buttons, a heart of cold. You are too cute. I love this. Stay golden. Those are awesome. Oh my. <laughs> anyway, just really, really cool ones. Do you have a favorite Star Wars like scene? I like some people have a definitely a movie, but like I think in terms of scenes, like what my favorite scene is. Oh my gosh, look at all the cutie Grogu ones. Oh my goodness, those are just the most adorable things ever. And I mean, I have definite fun scenes I love from each one. I also love the Hoth scene. Um, like there's just some really good ones. I don't know. All right. So now we're getting into the academic planner. For those that don't know, the academic planner is geared towards the school year, right? So it goes from July because you're planning stuff in July all the way through August. So it does go a full year, but instead of going the calendar year from January to December, it's going in terms of the school year. Um, so this one, again, July through August. So you do, you do hit the full year. And so here you have, you can put your class schedule in here. So this is great for kids or for adults, if you're a teacher, if you're going to college, or if you're a parent that's got kids in school, because your yearly, you know, kind of how your schedules are all like, at least for me, because all my kids are still in school, you know, my youngest is only going into grade six. So everything revolves around the school year and what's happening. So having I wouldn't put a cross schedule in there, but maybe I'll put like some key teachers names and things in here. Um, I do use planners. I like to write in my planners. I also use my Google online calendar. But I just love I love being able to write in a planner. And it's just so much fun. So I, I'm going to be using this one. I am totally because all my other ones have already been out to date. And I'm I'm love this one. I'm going to use the stickers. I'm just so giddy. I'm so excited. So we're starting in August. So this is just in time. You can still order this and still get this. Here we have August. Now, obviously, I'm not going to do projects and exams and stuff, but I do the daily things when I have like things that I need to get, do. So for me, it's like video footage, send that email, right? You know, make that graphic, you know, email these people, go live today, all those kind of fun stuff. And so here you can see we have all, then we have notes. So I can definitely, like if I've got meetings with notes, it can be for that specific month. Here we have luminous beings, are we? I love this. Then we're going into September. Then we go into, so here we have Yoda again. I got to see the front covers of all these because they're fun. The force is strong with this one. I love this. Am I? Yeah, I'm not, okay. Checking to make sure Instagram, you guys are, can see everything. So we're changing colors. We have new symbols every month here. I love that. We also have some important dates and deadlines. So that may not be a class. That might be like a big project I got going on that I got important dates and deadlines. So work with what you got. Force to be reckoned with. I love that. See, this is this is the Leia I love right here. And she's in this mode. That's my favorite Leia. Kick-ass Leia. Um, November. Here we got November. Here we're going into December. Got to have our Boba Fett in here. Oh, I, I missed the front cover. As you wish. Yeah, actually, that's the Mandalorian. Haha, <laughs> sorry. That's not Boba Fett. Here, the Force be with you always. We got some Obi-Wan in there. 
So here we got him and the teal. The color schemes on these are great. That's no moon. <laughs> so here we have the Death Star going in on this. Um, here we have a Jedi in training. So now we got a little bit of some Luke. And then here we've got move along, move along. We've got star stormtroopers up here. They really did a good job of like hitting some fun ones. Let the Wookiee win. <laughs> so I'm guessing we got Chewbacca in here, which is fantastic. And then ready for adventure. We finally got our Han Solo and then the little rebel. So we got some actual fighter jets in here. So it's just so much fun. Oh, it's fun hearing me geek out. Yeah, I'm, I'm a total nerd. I'm also, just as a heads up, I'm a big Lord of the Rings fan. I am, yeah, I'm a total nerd. I'm reading Ready Player Two right now, and they're in the part where they're talking about Lord of the Rings, and they just defeated this stuff, and it has stuff with the Similarian, and yeah, I, I, I'm a giant nerd. I, I am not... I'm not too proud to say that I am a total massive nerd. So here is some, I mean, and I grew up watching all this stuff. Like it's just, it's part of my zeitgeist. It's just, oh, it's awesome. So also they have these cool pins. I love how they're like triangular. It's so cool. So I have not played in here yet. Let's see if I can get these guys open. Got to be smarter than the container, Aaron. Grr. Oh, there is a sticker on here. See, you got to be smarter than the container because there is a nerd unite. Exactly. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I, I am, I've not, I don't get into certain things. Like I I never got into, um, Handmaid's Tale, like certain people get out the orange is new black. I don't know, but there's like Star Wars. I, you know, it's Harry Potter. I'm a huge Harry Potter nerd. Like I would do, I would rock out. Seriously, I got to be smarter. I, I, it's just, it's stick. Oh, there's another sticker. That's why. See, you got to find, find the stickers. Right. So Star Wars and I'm actually game for a lot of the most current Star Wars stuff. I'm also a big Marvel fan. I like watching all the new Marvel movies. I like Avatar. I like sci-fi. I'm a big sci-fi, but I've never been to any like the comic cons or anything. That would be fun to go to. So there's a sticker on all three corners when you get this. So make sure you open up all three corners before you try to take the lid off. The cool thing about these ones that they're triangular is that they won't roll off. I have pens that roll on me all the time. Now, if you're noticing, you're going to see little words on every single one of these. Here we have Stay Golden, Take the Galaxy by Storm, and let me grab, I'm going to grab a sheet of paper here. Pay no attention to what's on, it's just scratch paper. And I'm pretty sure, nope, so that's, they're black. That one's black. I was wondering if they were going to be the color of what was in here but they're all black. So, and it probably said that on the container. I just wasn't paying attention. So they're just pens. They're not markers. They're hundred percent. They're just pens. Um, but let's take a look because it says with marker set. So maybe there's, nope, there's another pen, but this one says, take the galaxy by storm. Luminous beings, are we? The force is strong with this one. So I'd love to know, do you guys have a favorite one that you like to watch? Yeah, they're all black. I'm just testing them because I'm curious. Galactic Hero. Here's my favorite color. Don't fly solo. Take the wookie. <laughs> I said that wrong. Don't fly solo. Take a wookie. Yes. I like that one. Here we have Fulfill Your Destiny. Oh, these are so much fun. And then here we have the force will be with you always. And yeah, so they are all pens, which means you have plenty of pens to go around and rebel leader. Oh, see, and it's the best color. That's the best one. Oh, they do have dual tips. Do they have dual tips on the back? So looking, no, I'm not seeing a dual tip on the back. It's just a singular pen. There's not anything. So it's just a set of pens, but they're still fun. I love them. They're cool. And they have really cool sayings. You can line them up. It is unfortunate they don't have different colors to go with them, but they're still cool pens. I think that's awesome. So Dragon Riders of Pern book series. Ooh. Morgan, have you heard of that one? Have you, my son's all into the different kinds of things. Dragon Riders of Pern. Have you heard of that? No. He, what's the book series you like? You like Fable Haven. He's really into Fable Haven. So, so Brandon Mull. That's, he's really into the Brandon Mull. I think you've read them at least three times now, if not maybe more. Fable Haven's like 30. <laughs> a few times, a few times. <laughs> so just to show you everybody again, all the fun things. So here we have the colored pens. Um, got, yeah, I geek out on colored pens too. Okay, so all the really cool pens. 
here we have the planner. Now, if you're not big into the academic planner, but you want to do the regular planners, so if you're wanting to have one that goes from January, you have a life planner, there is other options. And again, you can mix and match. If this is not the color, uh, the cover of your choice, you want this cover, you can get that. Um, if the baby Yoda, if Grogu is your thing, and if you want to have that as your cover or the journal, you want it like you can flip them, you can mix and match all of them. So they're just, they're really cool. And then you have the little planning thing. And this is just a small smattering of the, some of the products that they have that is the newest release for the Star Wars launch. Um, and if Star Wars is not your jam, there is definitely other products out there that are not, I'm going to flip this again. So excuse me, everybody. Hello. Um, so if, yeah, if it's not, Star Wars is not your thing, but you love planners. There is some other ones that are coming out uh, that are Erin Condren, newest release for the academic calendars. So this is just the one of them. But if you take a look, there is, they also have some amazing artists that they work with all over the world that do some of the covers for the planners and some other, I mean, they're just, there's really, really pretty designs that they put into them. And they really kind of go above and beyond in terms of when they think about like, just like the extra little bits on here, like the extra little doodads, you know, in terms of the stickers, all the different sayings that go into everything. And it's not just for the Star Wars stuff, but for some of the other ones. I believe they also have Hello Kitty. Um, and then there's like some really just pretty designs. So if you're into planners, check it out. They're cool. They're fun. Why didn't, oh, I lost connection on my Instagram. How weird. Anyway, okay. So yeah, there's just so much fun. So somebody's talking about how they love the original series for the Star Wars. They like the first. So that would be four, five, six. The first ones that got released back in the late 70s, early 80s, you know, with Luke, Lega, and Han Solo. Which, you know, we all grew up, like, it's hard to be like, I only like this one thing, you know, like, because we grew up with that. It's just part of our everyday everything. So yeah, it's just cool. Anyway, thank you guys so much. Don't forget my, I'm going to pop them up on the screen makers retreat there's only a couple weeks left to sign up and then i'm going to be shutting it down because i got to make sure i have all the kits and everything organized and i have a food planned and all those kinds of things but it is a little less than a month there's still a few spots left and i just want to show everybody who is watching on youtube and facebook all of the amazing companies that are sponsoring it so we are doing projects with Sizzix. we're doing projects with prickly pear stamps and dyes edding markers deco art water marbling we're going to be doing sublimation with craft express and art esprit we're going to be doing um ink blending with the crafters workshop in Catherine pooler inks uh, we got xyron for adhesive I feel like I'm missing somebody, but I mean, like, there's just so many cool projects. We're going to be doing card making, sublimation, oh, Style Tech Craft Vinyl. Um, we're going to be doing some home decor projects. So if you like to make things, this is the this is the place to go and everything is included. All of your food, all of your drinks, we're gonna be having some cocktail hours, all of your craft projects, swag bags included, giveaways are gonna be a part of it, and your lodging. And if you're a little bit picky about where you like to sleep and you don't want to sleep in the same house as everybody else, there is also some um, lodging that's just down the road. Like if you want your own hotel room, there is day passes that you can get. So if you're like, I only can come for Friday, well, then just do the Friday day pass and come. Or if you live nearby in the Austin area, you can do it that way. So there is lots and lots of fun. Do you have a video on the deco art marbling? No, but it is coming. I'm going to be doing some videoing coming after we do the event where we're going to be talking about the deco art. And just as a little, little tidbit, um, I understand that everybody can come to the in-person event. So this retreat is going to also be available as a virtual retreat a month later. So in the end of September, and there'll be the kits for sale. So you can still get the swag bag and the kits. You just won't get me in person. It's going to be all virtually. And I get that not everybody can come and to try to fly and all that kind of stuff. So there is a way to still be a part of this entire amazing event virtually. Uh, there's limited seats even for the virtual event for the kits, but unlimited if you want to be watching the videos and get some of the digital files and things like that. So lots of fun stuff yet to come. I haven't fully announced all the the virtual part of it yet. You guys, you're, you're getting the tidbit on it first, right? <laughs> All right. So thank you, everybody. And don't forget uh, our big event. I'm going to be working behind the scenes at the Create with Cricket Joy event that is starting. We're doing our launch party tonight. Um, and it's a free event. It's all about cricket joy specifically, but I have a maker and I'm able to do all the projects with the maker, but you also can get the files to work with your brother, your scan and cut. And if you have zero cut files, 
you can obviously also get inspiration and ideas from that because those are really cool classes that you can learn how to do. So maybe you can work together on all those things. So um, Pam's like, <laughs> Pam is coming from out of state. I love this Pam. And she's driving in and she's bringing, I think you said your niece was coming. So I, anyway, it's going to be a ton of fun. I'm so excited. I'm getting all geeked out about fun, the fun stuff that's going to go on with the retreat. My mind is like in retreat mode, but link to the retreat, link to the cricket event and link to all the Aaron Condren supplies are down in the info section. And for Instagram, they're in the in my bio, that's the word, their link in my bio. So have an amazing day. I got to jump on and wear my other hat and be producer for the event. And I will see everybody at the Cricket Joy event if you were there. It's free, so why not? Hey, all right, bye everybody. Got it.